My name is Dr. Shafi Buya, Founding Academic Coordinator and Program Manager of ITMD Bridging Program at the Chang School, Ryerson University. We have started ITMD Bridging Program to support new immigrant ITMDs in collaboration with GTA Healthcare Agencies to provide additional skill and competency for non-licensed healthcare profession. This one-of-a-kind program in Ontario helps with ITMD's individual and organizational capacity building as well as expand the diversity in Canadian healthcare system. And with the support of our power partners, our trained skilled ITMDs are able to contribute to Canadian healthcare system and Ontario's economy. Back home in Afghanistan, I was practicing as a psychiatrist and I was teaching psychiatry at the medical university for medical students. I feel like I have accomplished my kind of short-term goal to be in the profession, working in the field, in the field of mental health. We find that these uh, students uh, learn very quickly. Uh, they already know a lot about medical care and patient care, bedside manner. And so we are getting not only good medical knowledge, but we're getting a diversity of perspectives uh, from different parts of the world, which only help us get better. When my resume was seen by an interviewer and the person like, you know, started, oh, you're very good, very good. I started crying because all these years, in spite of everything on my resume, nobody has even bothered to pick it up, right? And somebody tells you that you are good oh my god you are good and you feel oh somebody is at least seeing my paper right i could not go beyond the reception of any hospital and now i am in that position where i go and meet directors or people from very high positions on a casual basis i came to canada when i was 10 years old from brazil and uh, my mother was a, a single parent and she had been a nurse back in uh, brazil and in germany many years ago and when she tried to establish herself as, as a nurse here in Canada, it was not possible. And she ultimately had to change her career path and, and worked in retail. And I think a program like what's offered at Ryerson would have been a tremendous benefit for her. I feel a personal connection to this program because I remember the struggle that my parents who were immigrants uh, went through to get re-educated here in Canada after being educated in Greece. In many ways, this hasn't changed decades later, and it's a catch-22. How do you get Canadian experience if no one will give you a job? That's why I'm very proud of this ITMD program. It's not only a 12-week program, it also has included in those 12 weeks a four-week internship or practicum. And I'm very grateful to the partners across the city that have given our students this opportunity. It was a very good program. They taught us regarding different methods of methodology of research, project management, and health field, and uh, great stuff like workplace communication and skills, which was really crucially important for newcomers. It's very much a win-win from my perspective. Uh, we're very happy to provide the student with an opportunity to integrate into a healthcare environment and provide them a bridging opportunity. At the same time, we get the benefit of very bright people helping us do what we do, which is to provide good patient care to our patients. I might be a good leader, I may be the head of the department in my country, but when I come to Canada, how I am going to bring the changes in myself so that I start feeling more as a part of Canadian workplace culture. I believe that program was the best for me. Other than that, like, you know, program manage, healthcare uh, project management, that was a very new concept for me. So I think it has made me a more systematic person in my personal life too.